out here in New York City, hip hop capital of the world. You hear the people, you hear the music. We're going downtown, we're gonna meet up with Felly, take a trip to his album release party tonight. It's gonna be live. We're in the East Village, we got my boy Felly here. Hello. Tell him, tell him a little bit what's what's happening tonight, what's what's this album all about, who are we talking to? Um Tonight's about wild strawberries. We made it, yeah. you know. We made it to the finish line. Tonight's the party. Tomorrow's the album. So how's the how's the transition? I mean, being from Connecticut, man, you probably probably run into the same people doing the same stuff, and shit gets repetitive. Like, how's your move out to this gigantic city, man? Like, how's that shit? It's chill. It's more. Everything's more normal. There's so many people and so much of everything that yeah. things aren't like as big of deals as they are in like Connecticut or nothing. Okay. So you just, small you're just humbled. Yeah, I just got the spot in Brooklyn because it was like a crazy space with like a rooftop area with like three beds and like it's studio vibe. It's like all I thought when I was in there, I was like, this is a vibe. No, you brought like that. You're getting the vibe. Yeah. You make beats and you make sounds and you follow sounds that feel like you're representing what's going on right now. trying to make my own shit because you could you could you're in charge of each sound and you have a lot of control it's cool but getting on other people's beats is fun too because then be, you become something new yeah yeah it's more people to collaborate with from the boosters innovator fella goosey i just threw away the loosely you should do so for no profits you put an album release you know <laughs> turn up <laughs> like now you know For the way, lie up in your grave. Liars in the day, we gon' need some more than chains. Why it up, my friends? Fake friends on the way. I'm in a higher place now. Bitch, talk to me, waste now. Right at the end of the day, son. Uh, renegade talking and whipping it all sound to see what the future may hold, so we're gonna go get some tarot card readings. I feel like they're gonna tell me I'm gonna die. Like, like, uh, all that shit. What up? We in this bitch just woke up. I forgot about it. We just played a show last night at Fairfield, and um, now we're gonna get our shit read. I don't know why I'm holding up my hands. This is it, with the cards, right? I feel like I feel like a nice mushroom trip is almost the same thing as getting your tarot card read. You know, like it'll show you like all right, same all right. dimension. I think it's similar dimension. <laughs> ripped up, dog. <laughs> They're awesome ripping up. squid up, dog. Nah, squid's gonna be cool. I just think he's like a nervous type. Like he, he like definitely gonna be like. Just, just got told. Gonna have some learning experiences, boys. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a <laughs> year of growth. I have some attachment issues. Right, next but summer, my foundation will be much better, and I'll be in a much better place. A lot of shit, like universal knowing, okay. like, a, like she said, like knowing, probably like a hundred times. Like your foundation kind of knows what to do, and you're good with animals. You're right. like it's like a light worker thing, and you have to like find that inside of you to be able, like people like being around you, and people feel comfortable. Like okay. you feel like it's almost like a social worker thing, you know.
What up, Squid? She rock your world? Yeah, she rocked with me. <laughs> she said that a woman character is gonna be brought to the forefront of my like business life. Taking a break, going on a walk, you know, not getting caught in that brute. Which I definitely feel that shit. Now we finally got our shit red. The other night it didn't work. We clearly, this is the time we needed to get red. Gypsy got good cards, I have pretty good cards. Squid got some alright cards. Uh, I think he got attachment issues on the low. <laughs> but uh, we about to go grub. I always made, I made my, I made beats for like eight years, I think. I don't think you can rap forever. And I think the guitar is like very timeless sound to it. And it's also like, a, uh, you could write, um, you could write songs with it. It's just like an inspiration thing. So we've seen the sights, we've seen the parties, we've talked a little bit about the process behind it all. Shout out to Feli for showing us around the town, showing us a good time, man. Talk that talk, what do you want to tell them? Shout out Elevator, thanks for fucking with me. Go get wild strawberry squid, you're a good man. Appreciate you, dog. Peace out.